Did you catch any of those bubbles? All right. Are you guys excited about Kids Blast? I know I am. All right, I want you guys to stand up and we're gonna sing our new song. Get your peaches ready, here we go. He's a peach of a savior, he's the apple of my eye. He brings back my branches when my branches get too high. He bears his fruit in season and his love will never die. And that's why I'm bananas for the Lord. Big ones, crunch. Glory, glory, we're the branches. Glory, glory, we're the branches. Glory, glory, we're the branches. And that's why I'm bananas for the Lord. Splat! Good job. All right, let's do it one more time faster, okay? Here we go. Got your peach? He's a peach of savior. He's the apple of my eye. He brings back my branches when my branches get too high. He bears fruit in season and his love will never die. And that's why I'm bananas for the Lord. Crunch! Glory, glory, we're the branches. Glory, glory, we're the branches. Glory, glory, we're the branches. And that's why I'm bananas for the Lord. Splat! Great job, guys. All right, so we are gonna review our memory verse real quick. Are you guys ready? Here we go. Exodus 20, 11. Now, wait a minute. I can't hear you. You gotta help me, all right? Exodus 20, 11. Good job. For in six days, the Lord made heaven and earth, the sea and earth, all that in them is and rested the seventh day. Great job, let's do it one more time. Here we go, ready? Exodus 20, 11, for in six days, the Lord made heaven and earth, the sea and all that in them is and he rested on the seventh day. Great job, I'm so excited that you are here. Come on, let's have our story time. All right, who knows how to play memory? It's so much fun, isn't it? Let's play a little bit, okay? So we just wanna find the matches. Let's see, where do you think that other match? Think this one? Is that a match? Nope, it isn't. Let's try again. How about down here? Um, that one and this one. Nope, that wasn't a match. Have you played this game before? It can be a lot of fun, can't it? Was that one a match? Nope. So, have you ever played a game, whether it's memory or a different game, and you played that game and the person that you were playing with cheated? It's not very much fun when you have a cheater, is it? No, it isn't. Makes you not want to trust them either, does it? Makes you even not want to play with them again, does it? No. Guess what? I'm going to tell you a secret. I set the game up and I put them all next to each other, right where I knew all the answers were. Guess what that's called? Is that called cheating? Yep. Does it make you wanna trust me again that I would be honest with you and tell you the truth and play the game the way that it's supposed to be played? It makes you wonder that, doesn't it? Yes, it does, because I broke that trust. Well, we are going to be learning about a man whose name is Abraham. And Abraham was having trouble trusting God. God made him a promise and God didn't fulfill it right away like Abraham expected him to. And so guess what? He was having trouble trusting God. But should we always trust God? Should. Does God always follow through with what he promises that he is going to do. He does. If God says he's going to do something, you can mark it down, it's gonna happen. People can make mistakes, but God cannot. God never makes any mistakes. And I want you to remember that because if God gave a promise, he will follow through with it. Thanks guys for being a part of Kids Blast. And I hope that you'll come and join us this Sunday morning at 11 a.m. at Crossway Church. See you guys soon. Bye-bye. Goodbye. -bye.